Agriculture is the backbone of the Nepali economy. Two-thirds of the population rely on agriculture for their livelihood. The nation's economic growth is not possible without continuing development of the agricultural sector. Though the nation has made efforts to develop this sector, income and living standards of poor and marginalised farmers and communities have not been boosted substantially. Studies have shown that substantial agricultural systems are the main reason for low-level economic growth and food insecurity for those living in rural and remote parts of the country. To address the problems faced in the agricultural sector, the UNATI project, financed by the European Union in partnership with Care Nepal and CPRED, has been implemented in six village development communities in Sinduli and one in Badibas municipality in Mahatori district along the BP Highway Road corridor. The UNATI project has been implemented in coordination with government and non-government organisations, private sector and local government district development committees and village development committees and municipality levels. UNATI project is a part of the project. I have been working on the project in the UNATI project. UNATI project is a part of the project. समीक्षा आ रूमा डिप्यार का बैठक आ रूमा बनी कृषि विकास कार्यलय को सौ आगे ताज हो रहा आगामी दिन में बनी कृषि विकास कार्यलय का उन्नति प्रोजेक्ट हमी सोंगे जाना चांस हो। The project has the major objectives of increasing incomes and livelihoods of smallholder farmers in Sinduli and Mahotari districts through fresh vegetable production and marketing. Okay, Nepal in its vision and mission is looking for a peaceful and harmonious society in Nepal where the poor, vulnerable and socially excluded people can live in dignity. So we're really targeting through all our products that we work with these, these groups. In the Onati project that is also the case. So we actively work uh, in Mahotri and Sindhuli district with small farm holders, especially women, to make sure that they can grow high quality uh, vegetables and also have improved and better access to uh, markets both in Nepal and in India. So with the impact of that product is really very good so far, um, really in line with CARES vision and mission. And we're very encouraged by the results. We can really see that women are much more economically empowered and that obviously helps the whole family to, uh, to improve their uh, the status, uh, social and financial status in society. And uh, the results so far have been very encouraging. The specific objectives of the project are farmers groups and cooperatives, delivering high quality support services and linking small holder farming households along the BP Highway Corridor to larger markets Kathmandu and Indian border towns. 1,000 smallholder households, 50% women, are engaged in and have improved the production of vegetables. र महिलाहरु में हेर्ने हो भने अझै सशक्तिकरण बढेको छ र समाजले उहाँलाई सम्मान गर्न थालेको छ र बच्चाहरु पढाउन शैली भएको छ त्यसपछि गएर स्वास्थ्यमा सुधार भएको छ यी 50 वटा किसान समूहहरुलाई चार वटा सहकारीमा आवद्ध गरेर हामीले बजारीकरणको सुरुवात गरिसकेका छौ र बजार उहाँहरुले उत्पादन गरेको तरकारीलाई बनेपा त्यसपछि गएर कालीमाटी बलफुसम्म पुर्याउने कामहरु भइरहेको छ 
This project expanded the commercialization of agricultural products in both districts. After the successful implementation of the project, youths who are used to going abroad for employment are being attracted back towards vegetable farming. Malai Unatile Direne Sagarn Vaikos and Malai Kipani Tane Tina Unati Nai Diego Bayazama you Istitima Pugnibani Tina Mala Unatile Tulo Sagarusa you Miro Life Ne Unatile Banaiko Farmers who used to work as daily wage labourers have been encouraged back into commercial vegetable farming. पहिला मेरो ज्यान पाल्ने मलाई घाउ छ पर्दथ्यो उहाँड आएर मैले यहाँ तरकारी खेती गर्ने यहाँ त्यहाँ दुनियाका भारी बोक्ने गरे ज्यान पाल्नु पर्थ्यो भन्दै अहिले मैले हेर्नुस अब यो एक वर्षमा छैन भन्दा पनि 2 लाख मात्रको आम्दानी गर्नु भए मेरो खर्च व्यवसाय कटाएर 2 लाख मात्रको गर्नु भएछ The project has provided a range of training opportunities for local farmers, businessmen and agrovets. Subjects include entrepreneurship, business promotion, marketing and government rules and regulations to be followed while selling or distributing seeds and pesticides. The project has provided subsidy for the purchase of seeds. Availability of subsidised seeds, materials and technical support has encouraged local farmers to engage in commercial vegetable farming. The UNATI project formed and mobilised a group of 50 farmers from the 1,216 farmers within the project area. This group and farmers are linked to four agricultural cooperatives trained in sustainable input and output supply management. The project provided training in leadership, account keeping and management of groups and cooperatives. As a result, 167 Dalits, 467 indigenous people and 752 women directly benefited from the project. अब हामी बेरोजगारी थियौ उन्नति परियोजना आएपछि हामीलाई धेरै चाहिँ हाम्रो लागि अवसरको कुरो ठानेर यसलाई लगनशील भएर खेत अब व्यवसायिक बन्दै जाने लक्ष्यमा छु म तरकारी खेती गरेर सहकारीमा आबद्ध भएपछि अब हामीले यो जति उत्पादन गरेको बिक्री वितरण गर्न सजिलो र सहकारी बनाउँदै जाँदा हामीलाई चाहिँ अब व्यवसायिक बन्दै जाँदा खेरि आफूलाई सर सहयोग व्यवहारिक रूपमा सबै कुराको हुनी रहेछ भन्ने कुरा बुझ्दै गएको छौं हामी The farmers groups and cooperatives have currently sold approximately 1074 metric tons of vegetables and earned more than 24.4 million rupees This trend continues to be sustained उन्नति यो संस्था आई कि ना देरे पर्यटन भाई राज्य गांव घर में जहाँ जो लिम्बा गोल्टारा बो बदरगाली बो ठाउं ठाउं में भाई राज्य Within a short period of its implementation, the Unati project, despite limited resources and means, has successfully benefited the lives of smallholder farmers living along the BP Road corridor. Local bodies have judged that the Unati project has been highly successful. It has set an example of how to successfully encourage the commercial production and marketing of vegetable products. यो कार्यक्रम यस जिल्ला को निमित्त अत्यंत ही फलदायी र लाभदायक छोव बनी मलाई लागे कुछ है। काम करता खेरी ये उटाले करे देखे रहे और कोई भी काम करने र स्वाकारी मार्गों काम करे को आखिर स्वाकारी को भावना थी। The role played by the project and its partner institutions in enhancing the capabilities of farmers has been substantial. 
Through training and exposure visits, the project has shown that the commercialization of agriculture can help in Nepal's economic growth. Local farmers are now hopeful they will receive further assistance. Taking the experience and achievements of the UNATI project, Care Nepal has introduced its super approach to agriculture with a view to finding areas where the experiences and achievements of the project can be further implemented. जलवायु परिवर्तन भइरहेको को परिपेक्षमा विभिन्न किसिमका चाहिँ प्रकोपहरु भइरहेको परिपेक्षमा डिसेस्टरहरु भइरहेको अवस्थामा केयरले चाहिँ एउटा कृषिमा सुपर एप्रोच ल्याएको छ सुपर एप्रोच भन्ने बित्तिकै यहाँहरुले के बुझ्नु पर्ने हुन्छ भने सुपर भने सस्टेनेबल हुनु पर्छ हाम्रो कृषि प्रणालीहरु त्यसपछि प्रोडक्टिभ पनि हुनु पर्यो अर्को चाहिँ इक्विटेबल भनेपछि सबै चाहिँ साना परिवार साना किसान महिला किसान र पछाडी परेको वर्गलाई पनि टार्गेट गरेर लक्षित गरेर हामीले चाहिँ यो त प्रविधिहरु सञ्चालन गरेको हुनु पर्छ त्यस्तै चाहिँ रेजिलियन्ट भन्छु हामी जुन के एउटा क्लाइमेट चेन्जको चाहिँ अब विश्वव्यापी जुन प्रभावहरु परिरहेका छ त्यो प्रभावहरु बटबाट बचाउनको लागि साना किसानलाई त्यसबाट उन्मुक्त उन्मुक्ति दिनको लागि रेजिलियन्ट हिसाबले पनि हामीले यो कृषिको चाहिँ प्रविधिलाई यसरी चाहिँ प्याकेज गरेर साना किसानसँग पुर्याउने चाहिँ एउटा लक्ष्य लिएका छौ Commercialization and marketing of fresh vegetables through the enhanced skills of the actors in the value chain, the UNATI project has successfully augmented income levels and improved the livelihood of the small-scale farmer. This is especially true for women farmers. If different organizations, institutions and the government of Nepal can incorporate the knowledge and experiences gained by this project into their policies and programs, it will answer a need. Effective implementation of programs that commercialize agriculture will help assist in the country's economic development while increasing standards of living amongst the poorest.